From what we can tell, the reasoning behind that was... The ousting of San Joaquin County Administrator Jay Wolverding came abruptly after a closed-door meeting Tuesday evening. Moving forward, um, the county decided to go in a new direction, the board, and um, it is what it is. Board Supervisor and Chairman Miguel Villapudua was the only one who disagreed with the vote to place Wolverding on leave. The chairman couldn't say if there was ever any kind of investigation that led to this decision or if they will address the reason with the public. It's irrelevant what happened in the past. We have a new, we want to go in a new direction. Jay Wolverding was first hired 11 years ago as auditor controller. Then in 2021, he was appointed as a county administrator. An important role as a county administrator works with 24 leaders from different departments to develop long-range policies to serve 742,500 residents. He's like our quarterback for the board, and uh, he gives us direction and what makes sense as far as um, what goes on with different districts in the county, whether it be the sheriff's department, the hospital, the airport. Will Reding's most recent contract was signed in February of 2022 with a salary of $365,000 a year. Last night, the assistant county administrator, Sandra Regalo, was named the acting county administrator effective immediately. We spoke with Wilverding over the phone, and he did not comment, citing that this was an unfortunate situation. Now with state budget issues affecting county revenues, the chairman insisted that this was not related to the decision to terminate the contract. In Stockton, Maricela de la Cruz, KCRE 3 News. San Joaquin County has a two-step process for this. The official decision for termination will be made on March 26th in an open forum. They will also decide how that contract will be terminated, including any payouts.